It is night before your first day of college classes and you have an 8 a.m. public speaking class and you set your alarm for 6.45 to make sure you get up and give yourself enough time to go eat breakfast and get to class. That night you go to sleep and the next thing you know you wake up and see it's 7, 10 a.m. and your heart drops. You slept through your alarm while it seemed at first impossible you were somehow able to eat breakfast and make it to class before the teacher does. All credit for this can be given to the electric bikes available to you on campus placed outside each and every dorm. This is only one of the many benefits of the electric bikes. Three of the main benefits of having electric bikes on campus are that they allow students to travel faster from place to place, get the most out of their college experience, and help keep students safer and healthier on campus. You can use the bikes from any of the eight locations all over campus. These, these bikes can help ensure students get all the important meals they need. In addition, the bicycle might also help them squeeze in breakfast, before class, or lunch between classes. For instance, for summer start students, the difference between making taking the bike and walking to McAllister is around 12 to 14 minutes for both trips. That's the difference between breakfast or lunch. If you're not impressed with the ability to get to places faster, maybe you'll like the idea of being able to utilize as much time as possible in a day. Another benefit is that these bikes allow students to complete more throughout the day on campus and off campus. They help cut off time traveling from place to place, allowing you to fit more in your schedule and be more productive and flexible. These bikes are time effective and cost effective, only cost $15 a year, giving you lots of flexibility and control over your time. Well, you might ask, is something so convenient, flexible, and time efficient also healthier or as healthy than walking? Yes, it can be. Electric bikes can help keep students safe on campus and can help benefit students physically helping long-term health. These bikes also can help students get away from things such as rainstorms, thunderstorms, or potential tornado warnings coming in. These bikes also have a tracker and a map that will help people find where they are if they are lost, since the app to check out the bicycles is GPS slash navigation based. There are also massive health benefits and physical benefits to using an electric bike. In Travis Edwards' article about biking versus walking, he found that taking bikes, electric or non-electric, can be better for burning more calories and increasing lower body strength. It was found that on average, walking burns nine calories per minute, whereas uh, biking for is 14. Not only can it help you learn, burn more calories on your rides to and from lunch and classes, but it can also improve your cardiovascular system. In Hood MWR's article comparing health benefits of biking versus walking, it was found that biking can improve your cardiovascular system by 30%. It can be beneficial long-term, especially for those with cardiovascular issues. So if you don't want to die since cardiovascular system uh, failure is the number one cause of death in the U.S., then start using electric bikes around campus. After hearing, the de after hearing the detailed reasons as to why electric bikes are great, suitable for college campuses, and how students are better off with them on campus, there is no excuse why anyone should ever give as to why they were ever late for class again. While they cost $15 a year, and you might think, hey, how many times am I going to use this? It's a pretty poor investment. You better believe that when the time comes and you need to get somewhere safe or be on time for class, a Clemson electric bike will come through for you when you need it most.